Hey guys, Matt Beck from freesaloneducation.com and a lot of you guys out there, salon owners, even stylists, are probably thinking, how do I get my business to be noticed on the internet? Well, I'm gonna show you guys a few different ways to get noticed and to make your business stand out online. So I'm gonna spin around, I'm gonna show you my computer screen and we'll get started. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna pull up Google. And what I've done is I've searched salon in New Hope, PA. Now that's where my salon is based, so this is something that I check on a regular basis to make sure that my salon is showing up first. Uh, and if you look here, it says salon gratitude number one. So that's, that's my salon. Um, the reason that we're showing up first is, first off, when you hover over this, you can see that our profile bursts up right away. Now, I've filled out every bit of information on my Google profile. Google loves when you are using their product to the fullest. So they're definitely gonna make your salon show up first if you're playing along with what they have to offer. Um, we also do a lot of YouTube things, which you guys can imagine. So uh, based on doing YouTube uh, videos and having a following through that, we show up first as well. So there's a lot of different aspects because Google owns a lot of different companies. So you wanna utilize all of that. Now you can see, so right through here, you can see all of our profile filled out, all the hours and everything. Um, now the other reason that we're showing up first is I typed in Salon in New Hope PA. Now the first part of our business name is Salon Gratitude. Technically when you call, we'll say Gratitude Salon, but I wanted on Google and in our business to be called Salon first because that's gonna make it show up first. That's what people are searching for. So you want keywords that people are searching for. So if you have a salon out there and you're trying to get number one on Google, make sure you put salon in the front of that name. Now, the other thing you'll notice the difference between our salon and the other places in this town is we have reviews. Whether it's seven Google reviews or 70 Google reviews, it doesn't really matter. Uh, it's, it just matters that we have more. Uh, so you wanna definitely collect those Google reviews, but we also um, are showing up, we have our Yelp, review rating, so we have reviews on Yelp. Um, we have a better rating than other salons, so we're gonna show up on Yelp first as well. So you're really just gonna look through there and figure it out. We have a good Facebook presence, so we're showing up on Facebook. So just by typing in Salon in New Hope PA alone, we're coming up one, two, three times over everyone else coming up one time. Uh, maybe two times. So we're, we're really blasting out there. We didn't even pay for an ad to go over here because we just work hard and we put it up there. Now, here's the other thing. If you click on our website, the reviews up here in the review section of salongratitude.com is from Demand Force. So all of this request an appointment and also read our reviews is from Demand Force. So all of these are Google searchable as well. So when you're looking through here and you wanna find uh, what your review is and what people are talking about your business or people are searching your business looking for what people are saying, uh, then they can go right here and find it on your website or also on Google that way as well. So there's so many different aspects to figuring out how to get your salon first on Google, but just make sure key things is use Google products to the fullest, fill out your profile on Google and that way people can find your business easier. So I hope this tip helps you guys. Definitely check us out right here on freesaloneducation.com. We have education videos on a daily basis coming out Monday through Friday. So stay tuned and we'll see you guys on the next video. Thanks.